my channel. I'm looking a little tired. So I've got my cup of coffee. And I'm super excited for this video. It's gonna be a pretty chill fall get ready with me. If I look a little rosy or red, I think I have some allergies. I just took some allergy medication because I have been sneezing nonstop. But nonetheless, I really wanted to get this video out. I want to share a fun little relaxed get ready with me and also share some new makeup products from a really amazing skincare brand that is sponsoring this video. So without any further ado, let's get right into it. So I do want to start off by just putting that on to push my hair out of my face. And I want to talk first about this skincare product. This is the OG um, Jojoba Glow Face Oil. And I do have moisturizer and stuff on right now. But this stuff, I've been applying every single day because it's so moisturizing. It really does illuminate your face. And my skin gets so dry in the fall and winter. We do tend to get seasonal dryness and so my skin gets so dry as soon as the cooler months hit and this just kind of adds that glow back into my skin so and i love the way it smells like something about the smell of this is so like spa like it's very relaxing and then i also have this is the og hydroganic sculpted lip oil i had this years ago and it was my favorite lip balm and then I didn't repurchase it for whatever reason and then I got it again recently and it has been another favorite like it's I'm re-fallen in love with it so love that great for lip prep I'll start off with my base which is just going to be my favorite Westman Atelier foundation I have been using this stuff non-stop uh, when I do wear foundation so I'm just going to Ooh, do, do. now I actually haven't self tanned in quite a bit so I feel like my skin may look a little bit more fair than my last videos and it's just because I haven't quite had the time a lot of work actually goes into self tanning it's it takes me about an hour to do like well so just using my beauty blender like when you can see like super up close and see exactly what it is that I'm doing I'm gonna use my Ilia concealer and I'm really just gonna focus that under I hope you're watching the storm don't think I'm going to set I'm gonna do a lot of cream products just to keep the hydration locked in so the products that we're really going to be showcasing in today's video are the OG Hydroganics Sculpted Face Sticks. So this is what the packaging looks like. So love the packaging and then you have the shade here and right here. So there are five different colors. We have um, Carnelian, which is a luminous coral. We have Rose Quartz, which is a rose blush. Amber, which is a sun-kissed bronze, copper, which is a radiant cocoa, and opal, which is a starlight white. You get three grams of products for $42. And once you take it out of the packaging, so this is what it looks like out of the packaging. You have the color here at the bottom, and it's got this beautiful magnetic clip, and then the twist top. So I'll do some swatches of the colors. So first we have the two more bronzy shades. So here we have amber. There is copper, so quite darker. Carnelian, rose quartz. So this is more of a highlight. So it has kind of a sheen, obviously 
on very fair skin tones it's going to be a little bit more difficult to see the contrast but definitely gives a beautiful sheen definitely suitable for very fair skin tones it's not going to look too yellow too gold it's going to look really beautiful so with that being said there are the five swatches but because i'm a bit fair i'll show you so there's amber and they're super smooth they just like glide on gives a really beautiful like light goldeny warmth to my face so i'll put a picture here of what that looks like kind of a natural light without the cool kind of tones that this is pulling through and then i think i might go with this rosier rose quartz for my blush because in the fall time we go a little bit more deep oh wait i didn't even put rose quartz i just put coral on my oopsie there we go Ooh. So you can blend it in to tone it down, but I love that. And even without the highlight, I feel like it just brings so much luminosity to your skin. And finally, we'll top that off with opal. like the perfect kind of just like white that just looks so beautiful and dewy and like glistening on the skin look at that like glow right there so just a little bit more information about the sculpted face sticks now these are actually formulated with a blend of essential fatty acids and oils which makes them super nourishing and they're going to just kind of melt into your skin melt into each other melt into your other makeup and look super natural they also have green coffee oil to help stimulate collagen cell tree resin which helps to refine appearance of pores and organic tapioca powder to smooth the appearance of skin and absorb excess oil so while they are a cream product they're not going to be like oil producing they'll just give you that glowy look without giving you that oily look which obviously i think a lot of us try to achieve we want that dewy glow without looking oily or shiny actually even used them for a photo shoot recently i just rubbed these all over my chest and decollete and they looked stunning so especially the bronze and the opal just give your decollete this like super radiant shimmery appearance i have a photo that i took at the beach with um those just like lathered on my chest and i'll leave the picture right here so you can see how beautiful that looks these are certified organic cruelty free not just on animals gluten-free all natural gmo and they're made in the united states so you have the bronzer the blush and the highlighter again they're quite buildable in pigment so you might see for example rose quartz if i just do one kind of streak it's a bit more sheer but you can build it up to a pretty deep pigment so i'm gonna finish off my makeup i'm gonna do my brows next i'm gonna use my plume brow pomade which i haven't used in forever i've recently just been using my ilia essential brow which is the gel but i kind of want to do a more defined brow just because everything else is super natural so just kind of playing back into enhancing those features this brush right here is the makeup of the day brush this is i think just their brow chicka wow brush Breathing thunder somewhere. i think i'm just gonna add a bit more of the brow gel just to floof them up and i think i might even where did i put so copper is that deeper brown shade right here. Might just add a little bit more just to my cheek area. 
a bit more bronze. I am a bronzer girl, so I do, I do like adding a bit more. And I'm even just using a powder brush to blend that in. Yeah, that just added a tiny bit more warmth that I was looking for. Really just been playing with these two shades from the Lawless palette. And it's like this super effortless brown kind of fall smoky. And you're only using two matte shades and it actually looks really nice. And you only need one brush to accomplish this look. So I just have my Honest Beauty Mascara. So lips. Lately I have been using the OG, this is the Hydroganic Sculpted Lip Oil Tint in Nolana. This is such a beautiful color. I've been using it a ton. I actually used it in my last Get Ready With Me video and it was beautiful, such a beautiful color. And they have quite a few different colors. Thing I love about these is that they have a pretty nice color payoff but they are so hydrating they're literally just like applying a lip balm like a tinted lip balm I love it so I'm not setting with any powder because I wanted to keep this look very fresh dewy you know just every day do we fall makeup just gonna finish off with some jewelry and then we'll be done gonna pop on some little hoops a nice dainty chain and a cozy sweater but i also like to do just have a little scrunchie here i've been recently Kind of parting my hair in the middle or just off center. Sleeking your hair, tuck it behind your ears. Either do like a low sophisticated pony or a bun. Let's just do a pony. Super chic fall natural makeup look. You got a little bit of smoke in the eyes and then that deeper kind of berry hued lip. Like it just looks very youthful, glowy, dewy, natural, but enhancing your natural beauty. So love, love these products. They wear well. They reapply well on top of like powders and stuff. Like they don't like fudge up any of your makeup if you are applying it over top of a powder. Let's say you are setting your foundation and you want to apply it that on top I have done that and it's been okay so obviously a plus and the packaging is an a plus I mean I find it very similar to the Westman Atelier packaging but um, at a bit of a fair price point so you're getting that luxe factor and yeah I'm super obsessed like even if you wanted to just top it on top of your eye makeup to make it a little bit more dewy or like smoky and glittery for a night look you can do that that is my quick fall makeup look featuring some of the OG's new sculpted face sticks I hope you guys enjoyed links down below to the products and if you have any questions feel free to message me comment down below and that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching, you guys, and I will see you in my next one.